Hi, Dave here. Windy day. Using a small soft box to um, make sure it doesn't blow over. If I had to put an umbrella on the light, uh, it probably would blow over. So I'm using a small uh, soft box today. One of the things when you get a bright sunny day and it's coming, sun's coming from almost directly behind my subject is that it's also bouncing off this green grass. And so that has a tendency to bounce up and into the face. And if you look at the face really close, and I don't know if you can see it here, I'm gonna zoom in in a second. You can see that uh, I am getting some green in the face. So one of the things you wanna do, and it's really easy to do with automatic exposure, is just, I'm using on camera or off camera flash and I'm just dialing down the ambient exposure making the flash the main light on the subject and that kills a lot of this green bouncing up in the face that's being reflected uh, from the sun. One thing I do for consistent exposure is I zoom in on the face and do an FEL lock every time I use flash. No flash on the image on the left, and to better see uh, the color cast, I'm going to darken the outer perimeter and zoom in on it, and you'll be able to see this green color cast on the cheek of the face. And the image on the right, I turn the flash on, TTTL, and uh, aperture priority mode, and I dial back the ambient exposure by about a stop. I'm a firm believer in letting the camera do the heavy lifting. So I got everything on automatic. I got uh, TTTL flash set on full. I've got it on aperture priority. And I even have auto ISO set. And I, all I do here is just dial down the ambient exposure by a stop or so, and I'm ready to go. It's just that simple. Using auto ISO, it doesn't matter if it's cloudy or sunny, the system automatically compensates. I'm using this uh, Flashpoint 200 Pro with a Godox softbox and I'm using this sender with the system and that's how I can control the flash from off camera. Pick a background with medium tone light on it, set the flash on the side where the color cast is coming from and dial back ambient exposure till you eliminate the cast. And if you don't have a cast, this system works great anyway. It's a very simple system to use. I'm Dave, L. David Likes Photography.